green. And I also track Todd Stowe is a single father of three. Three years ago, he had over $40,000 in consumer uh, debt, credit cards, loans, and retail day. debt. In the end, he had nothing to show for it. The world was coming down on me, truthfully. I felt like uh, a desperate um, that I was going to work and doing everything for somebody else and not for my family and not for my kids. Like most people in his shoes, he knew he needed a change. I had to show my kids better than being in debt. I couldn't have them seeing me like this all the time, struggling from paycheck to paycheck. Todd took a financial management class and hasn't looked back since. In three years, he's paid off over $46,000 and now only owes on his mortgage and his vehicle. How did he do it? By creating a budget, selling stuff, and living within his means. The biggest thing is you have to live with inside your means. You, if you make a certain amount of money, you can't spend more than that, ever. Other debt wreckers agree and say a budget is essential. Once you get the budget and you, um, you have success with it, it's the piece that holds it all together. The Morrows earn an average income, yet they were able to pay off more than $30,000 of debt in just three years. You just have to make the decision and the choice that we have to stop this behavior. Contrary to the norm, Todd and the Morrows only buy things with cash. They use an envelope system where a set amount of cash is pulled out every paycheck and literally put in envelopes for different uses, groceries, fun money, eating out, and other things. But... And once that money's gone, there's no more money going back in that envelope until the end of the month, until I get another paycheck and I refill the envelope. As for credit cards, pay them off and never use them again. Save your money and finance yourself. Do your own credit. Be your own creditor. Uh, we don't need to be a slave to anybody and certainly not to credit card companies. But what about that FICO score? Isn't it necessary? According to the Morrows, that's an old state of mind. That's because you're still thinking in a debt-minded mindset that I've got to have a FICO score so I can go finance something. So how do you get started? One, simply stop creating more debt. Two, get on a budget so you know exactly where your money goes. Three, start saving so emergencies can be handled without too much stress. How is life now for these debt demolishers? We don't think about our money all the time. And we were thinking about money all the time. I'm free. I am free. I have no You're debt. A debt I'm a debt wrecker. I'm a debt wrecker, <laughs> and I'm not going back in debt. Cassandra Webb, oh. K Texas News. Like I said, I've got my parents into this.